Madam, you want, you want to get a general assessment, a general assessment of the performance of the girls of Bright Lights for the future. What's the, what's the general evaluation so far? First of all, I want to appreciate the donors. I want to appreciate this project, the Bright Light Project, for this initiative. And going as far as getting these girls, the vulnerable ones in the society, the community, some of them usually come here with, um, you have to start doing counseling, you have to make sure that you put them into the learning atmosphere and all of that. But these ones, they came with a focus. They were already focused, they were determined of what they want to achieve. And they are really very enthusiastic. They have done well in the first session of the training. They have actually impressed us. We are very, very impressed at their performance. They want to learn new things. They want to venture to know what it takes in their career. So we are really, really impressed at their performance. And we're encourage, encouraging them to continue in that light. And I know that with uh, our partnership with Bright Light, more they are going to benefit and the community is going to be better. Right. Thank you. So, so what kind of education, what kind of foundation, what kind of vocation mm -hmm. do you impact in them? And generally, does OIC offer? Yes, we have uh, the hotel management and catering department where some of them are actually engaged. You have textile and fashion design. You have auto mechanics and motor electricity. You have information and communication technology department. We have building construction, plumbing and electricity. And we have um, um, ICT, as I've made mention of ICT. So these are the vocational training units that um, OIC is involved in and we encourage them. Sometimes we may encourage the female, the female to get engaged in male-related, what the, 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 the stereotype of male-related uh, fields, to get engaged in them. We encourage them to get into auto mechanics, into metal fabrication, welding and spraying and all of that. We also encourage them in that. Yeah, the last time we talked, we talked about holistic education you don't only build your um, academics but you also take care of your character and all of that it shed, shed some light uh, in this aspect please. um actually i think the first part of their training as um, you may have uh, seen we have uh, given them some tips on um, business techniques we have given them some tips on communication skills we have given them some moral education all of that in a bid to make sure that we try to shape them into the school milieu and to shape them into the community that we have done. And they are doing well. Thank you so much. Thank you.